Hello, beautiful people. Another day, another dollar. Today, uh, in true pregnant fashion, this episode is brought to you by uh, Olives, who are my pickle and olive fans out there. Hmm? Okay. So, Tuesday looks a little bit like this, peeps. What you're going to do is uh, essentially do a lot of pretty much just what you did yesterday. And then we will do a little bit more teaching on, uh, or I'll do the teaching, you'll do the sitting and listening on uh, Wednesday. We're going to talk about thesis and some stuff. So today, Tuesday, is a lot of like yesterday because um, it just makes the most sense. You are going to essentially open back up to your nonfiction personal book where you left off yesterday. Um, assuming you're not done with the fourth of your book, you will open up to where you left off yesterday. You will continue reading. Uh, in the last 10 minutes, you will switch to that same document as yesterday, still found in Google Classroom called Week 1 uh, Nonfiction or Personal Book Response. And you will probably on like this, probably most of you will be the second uh, line. You'll put today's date, the 7th of January, and then in the response, uh, the right response column, you will pick one of those three quick drop prompts, whatever applied to you most today in today's reading, with text evidence, you will respond. Just a really like, you know how I'm like big picture kind of teacher. The big picture of this response is you are not just, remember how we don't summarize. So the whole point is you're never summarizing what you're reading. That's boring to you, to me, to the olives, you know. So what you're gonna do is reminding yourself you are responding as a reader to on paper to, or on the computer to how you uh, feel as a reader uh, after reading or while reading that book. So that can be obviously a part, uh, it can be just straight up responding to the prompts, but it can also be you reflecting um, as a person who's reading that book. So like if you were choosing number one, how do you feel? Uh, a few of you wrote me, um, in your Google form and you said, you know, honestly, I'm not really feeling this book. Is that a response? Yeah. So uh, first of all, if you're not really feeling your book, I'm going to force you to read it a another day because um, I just want you to give yourself a little bit more time to make sure that it is not, a this is not many of you, but a few of you said that um, you've maybe read it before and you'd like to choose another one or this is not up your alley like you thought. Uh, when we get back, or when I get back on Wednesday, uh, the very few of you who have expressed that you um, need to switch up your book, um, you will get a new book on Wednesday. You'll have to figure out what that book's going to be, and I'll help you with that, but you're more than welcome to do that because I'm not going to force you to read something you don't want to read because, um, no, boo to that. So uh, please essentially read today. Do your... Uh, nonfiction personal response, and then do the, just like yesterday, the daily Google form for January 7th, the newest Google form, newest Google form to tell me how today went. Uh, the last thing I want to say is if you have reached the fourth way mark, the fourth mark in your book, do not read on. And if you have, I'm not mad at you, but if you have reached it, I want you to stop and you're not, you don't have study hall. You essentially are going to pick a secondary book that you're going to be reading alongside this. So you can pick from my shelves uh, or if you have a secondary SSR book on you, you're to do that. Uh, no one is going to the library today because uh, I just want to keep all of the community in the classroom. So if you could please just pick a book from my bookshelves uh, and check that out as a secondary SSR text, that would be amazing. If you are in 7E, you are allowed to work on 7E work if you get done with the primary work for today uh, with the personal book. Um, I don't think I'm leaving anything out. So basically read, respond, and do your January 7th Google form. I just want to uh, <clears throat> also just uh, give you a compliment that a lot of you did the Google form from yesterday, uh, from Mondays, and I just, uh, a lot of you said really nice things to me. Um, I mean, even if you didn't, I still love you. But for those of you that said really nice things or uh, those of you that have reached out, uh, I, you know I love you. Like, I'm super emotional, so uh, I just truly appreciate uh, you for being amazing students, and I will see you tomorrow, Wednesday. Email me if you have any questions. Bye.